Both Sable and Mark Marrow reportedly asked for their release from the new three-year contracts that they just signed a couple of months ago, but they were both turned down. WWF knows that they're going to get a lot of publicity out of the upcoming Sable Playboy issue, so they don't want her leaving right when it comes out. They have uh, also complained that Sable never trained to be a wrestler and didn't come to the WWF to be one, and that she doesn't want to wrestle at all. So I don't see the the bad there. We knew this. <laughs> yeah, I guess they were Marrow and well, Marrow and Sable were complaining about that. I guess because they were like, well, she wasn't supposed to be a wrestler, and you guys just threw her in the ring. It's like, couldn't she just say no? Especially if you guys want out of your contract, just say, say no. no. <laughs> they were the ones that signed the contract to begin with, and it's like. It, you know, you and I both have that. It's like, you know, if you sign your name on the dotted line, you know, you, there you go. You know, you, you honor the contract. Sorry, you know, you don't like it. But what gets me is like they just signed a new deal like months ago. And then they come up and they're like, we want out. Well, probably should have thought about that before you signed a th- three-year contract, buddy. It's a lot of people's problems. They see the bottom line, literally. <laughs> yeah. And apparently uh, Mark Merrill pitched. He's like, well, if I'm going to have to stick around, just make me Johnny B. Bad again. And they were like, we can't. That's the whole reason you're currently Marvelous Mark Marrow. It's because we can't make you Johnny B. Bad. So that didn't go over well. Second part of the story here. Uh, I'm sure you remember this. I'm sure you've seen it. Sable, China, and Debra were on a TSN show this week, and the conversation got heated with Sable and China shooting on each other and Sable accusing China of using steroids and trashing her for her plastic surgery. A lot of people in the WWF sided with China on this, feeling like Sable went way over the line. Yeah, I'm sure she's never had any plastic surgery done, right? <laughs> right. Yeah, I know. And the whole thing, I, I don't remember word for word, but I just remember they asked China, it's like, well, why aren't you the women's champion? She said, well, I, I don't have any interest in wrestling the women. If I ever did, I'd win the belt in three seconds. And Sable was like, well, how can you say that? You've never faced me before. And she's like, well, I'm three times as big as you. He's like, well, what do you put in your body to make yourself three times as big as me? And just going on like that. And it's like, my gosh. And yeah, they both took jabs at each other about steroids, or uh, not steroids, uh, plastic surgery and whatnot. So, Yeah. Bruce Pritchard said, yeah, the heat fell on Sable because nobody liked her in the back. But at the same time, he said, as far as the office went, heat was on both of them because neither one of them handled the situation properly. And they said Deborah was there. I don't remember Deborah being there, but if she was there, I can imagine her like just in the fetal position in the corner, just like trying as hard as she can to not be on camera. (laughs) (laughs) She's like, I'm going to let this one explode and I'm not going to be anywhere near it. New girls in the corner, puking her guts out. 